election day here in the United States and nothing will change. Coming up next on Pastor Bob's Coffee Break. It's election day, and uh, boy, there are expectations everywhere. Everywhere is everyone is rooting for their own candidate, and everyone is hoping that massive change is going to happen. And you know, the world is always in change. Our history shows us that we've gone through good times and we've gone through bad times. Yeah, and you know, we're hopeful for a lot of things. I think we always are during an election day. But I want to remind you that nothing is different. Let's go back to John chapter 1 and verse 1. And it says, In the beginning was the Word, Logos, the living Word, Jesus Christ. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. And Jesus Christ established his part of the Godhead there. And long before that, Genesis 1-1, in the beginning, God. And let us make man in our image, he says. Father, Son, Holy Spirit, the mind of Christ. So we have the same Godhead, the same triune God, who began all of this, who created the world, created everything that we see, has not forgotten about you and I. In fact, the Bible says that he created for six days and then rested on the seventh day. Why? Well, because there wasn't anything left to do. It was finished. His creation was done then. Everything that he put into motion was finished at that point. And then another pivotal point in history was when Jesus Christ died on the cross and said it again, it's finished. Everything that I came to accomplish, I have done now. And so not only did he create the world, but he created a situation where you and I could be saved. Is anything a surprise to him? No. Is there anything that happens that doesn't have the foundation of his creation, both physically and spiritually, in our lives? Is there anything? And the answer is no. So what changes during election day? Well, the course of government will change. The course of freedom might change, how we view things might change. But folks, from the beginning, the beginning of creation in Genesis, the beginning of the story of Jesus Christ and his redemption in June, or in uh, June, what am I saying? In John, all of that is still the same. We're still on that particular uh, mindset and we're still it's still the glory of God that runs all of this and Jesus Christ decided to put all of this in motion for a reason he rested seventh day he rested why because it was finished it was finished still is everything that he gave us we still have Everything that he put in motion is still in motion. Jesus' death on the cross to forgive us our sins and to create a pathway for eternity for us is still the same pathway. And although things around us might change a bit, and during election day they always do, the one constant is that God never changes. He's still the same today 
yesterday, tomorrow. I like that part. And folks, we can be secure no matter how an election turns out. No matter how many things we see that don't feel right or don't feel fair or whatever it might be. We know that God is still on the throne and Jesus Christ changed everything. Folks, don't forget, you are blessed. Go and be a blessing.